On October 12, 2024, VTM News reported that several military barracks in Belgium have significantly raised their security measures following credible threats of sabotage and espionage. Confirmed by Belgium's Ministry of Defense, these heightened security protocols come after a thorough assessment by the General Intelligence and Security Service, ADIV, leading to an increase in the threat level from Level 1, Alpha, to Level 2, Bravo, at specific installations. The intensified security primarily targets defense personnel, with a particular focus on those responsible for guarding the affected barracks. While details about the specific security adjustments remain undisclosed, it is evident that these measures are in response to heightened concerns. The measures apply to a limited number of military sites that had reportedly received concrete threats. These changes were implemented on October 11, 2024, and will remain in place indefinitely, underscoring the gravity of the situation. This increase in security measures in Belgium follows a pattern observed across Europe, particularly in Germany. Earlier this year, Germany implemented similar security protocols at various military bases due to escalating threats of sabotage. In August 2024, NATO's airbase in Geilenkirchen, located near the border with Belgium and the Netherlands, saw a sharp rise in security in response to a potential threat. A more alarming incident occurred just weeks earlier when a German airbase near Cologne was temporarily locked down after a breach was discovered in the base's drinking water facility. Security personnel detected abnormal readings in the water supply, sparking fears of potential tampering. The breach was followed by immediate security measures, which were also extended to other German NATO bases facing similar concerns. These actions reflect the broader security challenges faced by European countries, particularly in light of Russia's ongoing covert operations. The growing threat of sabotage, espionage, and cyber attacks targeting critical infrastructure has become a pressing issue for NATO and its member states. In Belgium's case, while no direct link to Russian activity has been confirmed, the country has previously been a target of pro-Russian hacker groups. The heightened security measures in Belgium and Germany are not isolated incidents but part of a larger trend of increasing threats to Western military operations. As Russia continues its covert efforts to undermine NATO member states, the use of sabotage and espionage has become a cornerstone of its strategy. From cyber attacks to physical acts of sabotage, these tactics aim to disrupt the logistical capabilities of military operations, especially those supporting Ukraine in the ongoing conflict. Security analysts have pointed out that these recent incidents could be part of a broader strategy to weaken European military capacity. The attempted sabotage of water supplies at German airbases and the rise in fire incidents at defense facilities indicate a concerted effort to destabilize military readiness. NATO's growing concerns are centered around the vulnerability of military installations and their critical infrastructure, particularly in light of the ongoing war in Ukraine. The Belgian government's response to the recent threats is in line with a broader European effort to protect critical defense infrastructure. While no official connection has been drawn between these incidents and Russia's covert operations, the pattern of sabotage and espionage closely mirrors the tactics used by Russian-affiliated groups targeting NATO countries. The ongoing challenges posed by these threats have led to heightened vigilance across the continent. As the geopolitical landscape in Europe becomes increasingly strained, European nations, including Belgium and Germany, are taking more decisive steps to safeguard their military assets. The international community, particularly NATO, will continue to monitor these developments closely, understanding that the security of these installations is critical not only to national defense but to the broader stability of the European region. In conclusion, the recent increase in security measures at Belgian military barracks highlights the growing threat of sabotage and espionage in Europe, exacerbated by geopolitical tensions. This escalation in Belgium, along with similar events in Germany, underscores the importance of vigilance and robust security protocols in protecting military infrastructure against a backdrop of increasing covert operations from adversarial states.